Okay, we are already uh, logged in to our IPC and we are moving to our last tab, okay, which is texture. So I have chosen this beach chair right, facing the beach right, as uh, from the sample. And of course, you can see there are quite a number of texture that you can work with okay all here you have your own texture that you can upload but uh, this one is harder to use all right uh, of course you can change it like for instance you can actually still uh, work with the lighting okay but uh, you can play around with the fade but right now, I'm not going to go into the own texture because that tends to take up a lot of work. But we'll use some of those that are already there. Okay. The second one is a paper texture. Oh, so you can see. What? It doesn't look like a photo anymore. It looks like a paper. And there's a number of paper texture. See, like those drawing paper, crumple up paper. All right. Uh, right, so you can play around with this right, even those on uh, wording papers so right, it's just like those that uh, you're printing on papers that's already used for words so you can see a number of effects right, so this one look pretty old okay okay let me just cancel this all right you have the gunch again there are quite a number but right? sort of like a bit dirty all right old dusty uh photos that you can get all right maybe some on your attic or storeroom and you find them somewhere like right? they got some stain around them okay so you can see quite a number of them all right just to show every one of them Then you have the fabric. Fabric is like uh, cloth. All right, fabric is like cloth. So it has like it's a print. It's like printed on cloth. Okay. This one is the fourth one. This one is a little bit rough. Okay. All right. Okay. then you have light leak which means that the photo doesn't come out very nice and smooth right it looks like it has been overexposed like for instance here see it suddenly have uh, too much lighting all right so it becomes blurred oh all right this part is now blurred okay all right so you can see some uh, lines over here okay so this one is the corner one corner and the lower corner uh, here this one here have one big patch and the last one okay looks like this okay one patch here one patch here so it's like uh, light leak okay you also have lights let me just discard this and go into lights oh, okay this one is interesting okay it's just to have having a lot of light exposure all right okay. zigzag lines all right like playing with fireworks this one is more like horizontal lines okay all right a simplified zigzag line okay this one seems to like zoom in all right so it's some like exploding line and this one okay is a diagonal one all right then you have another that looks like material different type of material like the picture is being printed on different type of material all right this one looks a little bit like leather Okay. 
Okay, so this one looks like watery. Alright. Okay, let's cancel this. Okay, you have a uh, nature. Okay. So they actually use nature team to create the special effect. Alright, so sort of like droplets. Okay, so this one is more bluish color greenish all right this one will be more like cloud base so you can see like something like that okay and the last one is the miscellaneous which doesn't actually fit anywhere okay so this one looks like smoggy okay crack earth similar this one is similar. All right. And the last one. Okay. So all of this is under the photo editor, this part. Okay. But beside that, okay, you don't always have to only work with one photo. You can actually do a collage. Okay, all right. So there is still the collage, there is still the designer for you to actually explore, but it is not inside this particular course because this course actually work more onto the photo editor itself. Okay, but uh, collage basically is to arrange a number of photo together side by side. All right, that's what collage actually means. And of course, if you like to design things from scratch, uh, you can try this one out. Okay, there you can actually work on the layers. You can work on the okay. Then you can actually work on things one by one. Okay, all right. So collage, you can actually add in a number of pictures. All right, all one at a time okay or all of them at the same time is up to you okay so you can actually add pictures in or you can select pictures and actually add them in okay it's really up to you to why right? so you can actually put all of them together and then you can print them out all right so i hope you have lots of fun all right explore your creativity okay then see what you can create or maybe you can create your own uh, birthday card and so forth. All right. So create something that is truly unique, one of the kind, right, by you. Okay.